From the man behind the COVID lockdowns to the people pushing dangerous gender ideologies onto the youth of America, they all have a glaring thing in common. They are Catholic. The NFL speaking out against Kansas City Chiefs kicker Harrison Butker's college graduation speech last weekend. While COVID might have played a large role throughout your formative years, it is not unique. Bad policies and poor leadership have negatively impacted major life issues. The athletes facing criticism for referencing his conservative beliefs in the commencement address. Seemingly attacking Pride Month, President Biden's policies, and imposing his thoughts on a woman's role in the world. But I would venture to guess that the majority of you are most excited about your marriage and the children you will bring into this world. I can tell you that my beautiful wife, Isabel, would be the first to say that her life truly started when she began living her vocation as a wife and as a mother and embrace one of the most important titles of all, homemaker. Now, Jonathan Bean, the NFL Senior Vice President and Chief Diversity and Inclusion Officers weighing in. In a statement to People saying the football player gave a speech in his personal capacity. His views are not those of the NFL as an organization. The NFL is steadfast in our commitment to inclusion, which only makes our league stronger. Harrison's speech is also drawing even more flack for quoting his teammate Travis Kelsey's girlfriend, Taylor Swift. As my teammate's girlfriend says, familiarity breeds contempt. That quote, a lyric from her hit, Bejeweled. Of course, Swift is known for promoting female empowerment. The Kansas City Chiefs have declined to comment on Harrison's speech.